Okay, you've been at YouTube about to do your now start. Mm. Ah, I want to <laughs> Hello, guys. <clears throat> My name is Naya, your favorite YouTuber. Today, I'm going to be taking her position. I, I don't talk like that. <laughs> so, hi, guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If I see for the first time, my name is Naya. Welcome to our channel. Yeah, be subscribe, like, we do a beautiful YouTube things. Leave a comment down below. Please don't make this your last time. Make sure you stick around on the channel. Check out our previous videos and everything. If you are a returning subscriber, hi, baby. My welcome back. I apologize for audio noise around the because we can't control the noise. So just manage it. Because I look too pretty. She said that, yeah. So this is my childhood friend. She was T. Introduce herself to the world. <clears throat> my name is Trust. Okay. Um, I'm a student uh -huh. in Adikula Jackson University. Okay. So. And she's a model too, guys. Right. Yes, she's too. a fucking model. <laughs> <laughs> put, I'll put her hand down below. You guys should follow her. Yes, follow her on her, on her page and see some nice, nice garrets. If you don't get forget about it. We're talking about um a particular topic. I think I've stated earlier on. This year, we'll be talking about a bit of undiluted truth and solicited, an unsolicited opinion. Why do you go be like twist, tongue twister? So that means that some things that we might say here, yeah, you might not agree with it, and it's not my first you agree with it. Therefore, the first question I'll be asking trust. See, this is not like a question, so this is like a discussion. Discussion we're gonna be discussing is Do you think there's still love on this in your sincere opinion? Do you think that there's still love on the streets of Nigeria, Lagos, the streets? <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> My sister opinion. I don't know about yours. There's no love in the streets. It was fucked up, man. There isn't any love. Love to you know. We only get motherfuckers. Who like there's no love in the streets okay. for me. I think I will agree with her on that. That there's no love in the love in the street. Love is like 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 finding love is like looking for one grain of rice in the plenty sand on the street right now. Why should you even find love in the first place? Because everybody needs love. It's, it's not something you should look for. It's something that's supposed to like if you have it inside you there's no there's no how you should yes, look for it. There's I no feel like you should love yourself love first <coughs> before you <coughs> love anybody. <coughs> that's what I feel honestly because why well, you know how to love yourself and you know and you because, know your words. Nobody will treat you anyhow, honestly. When you love yourself, Sha. But if you're looking for love from somebody else, the game outside there is not nice at all. You shall get heartbroken. If you love yourself. Love will come find you. Not you going for love. How true is or that? Going to good for love. That's not. Love. If you love yourself, take care of yourself. <clears throat> Be with yourself. Know yourself. You attract. You attract love. We should take care of ourselves. We still attract guys that are shitty. How would you take care of yourself? Very well. A lot. Like I, I, I see fancy things. I love to get for a guy at a relationship with. I do not mean myself. physical. I mean. In now, your in now, like how my, well do you take care I of your protect my space? In yes, yes, a lot. Your space, mm -hmm. and that's that one part of it. So, okay. how do you treat your mind? I mind and that stresses my mind. I cut it off. Why now? People say they take care of themselves. Mm -hmm. um, it's it's at that that moment. Um, I, I just feel it's more like you not being in a relationship with anybody. I don't mean like your female friends might mm -hmm. just be like a guy like into a romantic relationship loving yourself has to do with you being in your space like being alone knowing yourself comfortable in yourself yes. be self-aware of yourself mm. Mm -hmm. like you know staying away from bad energy you understand that kind of stuff mm -hmm. you know so if you have those things you kind of like detect you know if you love yourself more if you understand yourself if you know what you really want mm -hmm. you will detect when someone is you you would say you detect somebody that is not that does not have not that no that does not have love in him or her. I, I feel that way. Okay, so what because, you, what you're trying to say now is that most people on the street that do, that don't give love. Many of us, all of us, we don't. It's and it's sometimes they don't love themselves. First. Yes, and sometimes it's very hard for us to even love ourselves like that. We all of us keep on saying that I have to take care of myself. I have to like love myself, but it's difficult like i don't know what to actually put it. we always myself. feel yes it's difficult okay most times we like to that's why most times we go out to go i'm looking for happiness from 
from where we are not supposed to even get it from. Okay, not to divert or anything, but do you feel like treating your body, going for um or this body, whatever might be, I'm not judging anybody that do it is your choice. Mm-hmm. You feel like it's part of you don't love yourself, that is why you're doing those kind of things. I don't get it. Like when you go for body enhancement, all this thing. Because you know, this time in my life, I wanted to actually have bigger ass, and I was looking for what's the name? What is a um, but oil and oil and oil and oil, but eventually I just dropped the idea. I'm like, whoa, bigger, 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 bigger. I mean, just for everybody just trying to like get a validation, like. They want to look good. They don't don't follow the things. trend. Yeah, that kind of stuff. Like they want to, you know, catch everybody's eyes and everything. You want to set out at, of, like everybody's looking at you like this baby's hot. So why should you go for lipo? I don't know. People like it. If you if you like it's your it, body, if you have the money, you can do it. But yeah. in norms, if you love your body, if you love yourself, you love yourself. if you love yourself, you won't care about what other person like you know. Yes. Say about you. Once you, you get, get comfortable in yourself. Yes, like, you get care. comfortable in your space. True, true. But that's to our question of love or no love on the street. Man, I feel like everybody's walking around the streets wanting to just empty. fuck each other. And that is it. Nobody knows. We are all empty. Is. Nobody knows what love exactly. is. Nobody, we are all empty. Nobody. That's how we are looking for that's how we just walk, just keep walking about looking for love, looking for who to make Why us happy. Why we don't even know what love is? Like Why you can't even make yourself happy. How do you guys the camera went off in the middle of our heated points were dropping and new update to be end some voices in the background a voice in the background and she can't join because of she's currently not camera capable right now she's camera handicapped right now you get the point so <laughs> so she shall be talking at the background and if you can't hear her of course what she's saying down below i can't remember what we were saying we can't remember what we were saying but let's go to the next point which she raised her name is bella she has an id page i put a page down below so you can follow her up to so bella asked the question that why do we always equate um love money and what no like in the sense that maybe um a particular guy just keep calling calling us texting, texting us giving us gifts giving money attention and and everything. why do we always equate love? it to love like why do we always say okay this is love that is the question on ground right now i feel like it's because like you said earlier on that most of us don't know what love is. We don't know what love entails. We don't know that okay, this thing that this person is doing for me is a normal thing that everybody can, can anybody can do for me because you like me or you love me. And then it all boils down to our parents because they don't even show us that okay, this is what love is. If I mean, if my dad calls me every day, every morning, check up on me and do all those things for me, I'll be like, okay. And when the guy does for me, I'll be like, it's a normal thing. Like I give just an example that I don't think he can come now and use phone and all these things to weigh me because my brother has gotten it for me severally. So it's not really like love, love to me just because of it's a normal thing. Does it make sense? How could it make sense anyways? In my own opinion, I just feel that someone uh, well someone actually that is actually in love with you can also, you know, call this that kind of stuff, shall give you attention, you know. But I don't, I don't, I don't feel those things. That like somebody show you those stuff is love, like because you know some girls once a guy is just like keep calling you constantly, send you money, <laughs> send you money, give you roses and everything. Those things should it should just be like num- what like anybody can like do. Like your get. friend, even your friend. Because most times after after, after everything. This person you feel that, that you claim that loves you and everything, I still end up, you know, leaving you heartbroken. It does not feel. People don't, okay, that people, people don't fall out of love. If, if you love something if it's genuinely. True. If it's true. Because it's I don't get this thing. People keep saying that, okay, we decide to go our separate ways. Because after like 25 years of marriage, I feel like I will fall out of love or something. But like, fall out. I don't know what, what, what. <laughs> you don't fall out of love, honestly. And, I don't believe in love at first sight. <laughs> Trust that's, this now. Trust that's not my one because this I feel that now. love is something you're supposed to like. You're supposed to grow. Like as you're getting to know this person, love like you start going in love. You start okay, this person okay, mm-hmm. I can deal with this. I can deal with that. You can't just come if you tell me that you the, the moment you fall in love with me, in, the moment you saw me, you fell in love with me. That, I, I, Practically, like you are just after my punani. Yes, <laughs> like it is what it's Period. what it was what you saw. I mean, what you see that got you. Just like, a lot of camera that um guys are attracted to what they see. Yes, like 
they love what they see, so they come like, for you. I just feel that's how God kind of. I just feel that's how God like designed them. We ladies, like, we get to your personality, what you have to give. Exactly. To what exactly? Exactly. So that's that's what like, she said. Is a is a is a is Yes. Most but is it, is it, we're not saying you should cheat because it's not good. <laughs> Don't do that! Is it for guys to cheat because they, they mostly they are moved by what they see? Not I'm not moved by what I see. Hallelujah. So either yeah. the, the, oops <laughs> or the whatever my be you get it. Be but you see that a, a, a guy can be with a girl for like a very long period of time mm-hmm. and he won't love her. And once he see something that he likes, we just now nah. like telling girls, truth. guys are more intense with what they like. They are more. They are more intentional about what they want. All my girls, guys are mostly confused. That is cheating. Like a guy can cheat and still be in love with somebody else. Yes. A guy, yes, a guy can yes, be with you for years. Yes, and but still once a girl cheats on you, just know that she doesn't love you. Period. No, Period. But but it's it, rare. It's rare. Though, it's very rare. For real, though, back to the same. Why do we feel giving? Those I things. What? Them. Yes. That's what I said. Do you know why? Saw, do you know why? Because from the guys, beginning, parents, parents don't nowadays do don't, don't take care of their kids. They just they just leave it to grow. Like, see, I saw one thing online that guys of the generation take your female daughters on dates, buy them surprise things, so that when other guys do it, they can differentiate that this now, is a the, normal thing. There are videos thing. I've seen online and on Instagram that yes. a man will take his daughter out on a date. My kid sister, I try to give her as much as I can give her so that when a guy comes, it won't be like I'm dating this guy because of I'm dating because of what he can give See, me. I don't, I don't buy the, the, the idea of you telling me that you don't owe me anything. If you are my friend, you owe me loyalty, you owe me commitment. I, that I don't believe that. See, I don't believe that. See, see, if you're my friend, I if you're my friend, if you're my boyfriend, Sorry? exactly, exactly the way it is. Okay, why do you feel that like your boyfriend owe you commitment, owe you loyalty? No, he does not owe me anything, literally. I okay. promise he does not owe me anything. So, so why? Okay, why, why do you get hurt when he cheat on you? Yes. Because he shouldn't do that. That means you are expecting him to do those things for you. I feel like we humans get so much hurt because we expect too much from guys. I get hurt when you cheat on me, though. But I know that you're oh, human. What are the things? Yeah. What is the thing that is too much that you are expecting from somebody? I don't know. <laughs> exactly. You see, what exactly. Why? I feel human. Every, everybody with their own opinion. You get, from, what, you get what I'm saying. From, I have an auntie and, and Pamela. She, from young, from then she's younger. Everybody, she see, told me something. See, if, that if, if, if you don't know, expect you, more, expect the worst from people. You know, no, that's not love. You can't expect people. people. That means ah, I, I know, we no, don't no, even no, no, understand. We. We don't understand. We, see, let's let's forget about dating. Let's forget about dating. Let's talk about friendship now. Yes. Let's talk about friendship. If you're my friend, you call yourself my friend. You owe me loyalty. You owe me commitment. You, yes. you don't tell me you don't owe me anything. Okay, the person that, that doesn't give you this thing score. Okay, what what is what do you, what is friendship you call, to you? Will you call someone like that a friend? You know now. Please, it is. I, I feel like it is normal for those things to be given, but see, you don't it expect is, see, it. No, you see, it is normal. You need to. That that that, that we still go back to. You say something. Every every, 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 every relationship. Every relationship. every relation. Every relationship. Eh? There's always a benefit from it. For so when we don't get that expectation, so we tend to like that feel hot. That's, see the other person. Yes, person. like I like money. Simple. So that no, see, that's no see, that being said, see, naya, that means naya, that wait, that, see, means, have to be, like, that means that love is actually transactional. Is that what you're trying to say? Huh? It's like a transaction. You give love, you receive love. Aside giving love, there's something else again that is transaction. Like we said that the part of um, you expect some things from some people and um, something about relationships. Don't get me wrong. I'm telling you that if you have, if you have, if, to me, oh, I don't know about other people. People keep telling you, yeah, I don't owe you this, I don't owe you that. If you are dating me, you owe me, you owe, you owe me commitment. We owe ourselves commitment. We owe, we owe ourselves loyalty. We owe ourselves communication. If you're not ready to make to make the other sacrifice, okay. fuck off. To me, though, I feel like these things are okay. I'm going into a relationship. Mm. It is normal for you to do this thing. Normal for you to now. You know that everybody is a human being, mm-hmm. and everybody is entitled to their own opinion and whatever it might be. Mm-hmm. Now, this person that you are expecting, like you give so much, you say, okay, I'm in a relationship with you. You owe me this. You owe me that. It is. It is every normal human being that they trained with, have home training, would know that. Okay, this. Okay, I'm, I'm dating this girl. What this? What? 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 I should give to this girl is this or that. You and your partner know what you're giving this person. Don't expect it from this person Damn because this, you have this. This person is saying I should give this thing to that because he because feels that he owe you that particular thing. Because you have it, you shouldn't expect that thing from that person. This is not exactly what I said. You cannot give what you don't have. Exactly. No. But you that you're going into a relationship, no. you're you're supposed to know that. I feel hey. these are basic things that every human being know. Okay, when you wake up in the morning in the Nigeria home, what are you supposed to do? 
I just want to clean the house. You know you this. Are you are expected. You, you are expected. It is a normal thing that be See, given to you. You are expected. So if, you were taught. You were you are expected to sweep in the morning. Yeah, they were saying the same thing. You are actually, expected. If you can see, it. but what, what me I'm saying is that everybody knows what they are going to do. Face. <laughs> everybody knows what they are going to do. So you're your part. Can we just expect the worst from people? Can we just? Can, can we just? Can, I'm not saying you should expect the worst from people. So I'm not saying you should expect the worst from people. If if you start, if you keep, if you keep. Uh, having that mindset, you might end up. I just feel expect worse from people. Just prepare your mind for for either worst or bad. As you are enjoying this moment, just know that a day is coming that it's not going to be sh- that it's not going to be sunny or whatever it is. Like we said earlier, let me just this let me just let me just. Everybody just, has their different opinions about this. Exactly, everybody have their different opinions. I respect that. Can, may just feel that loyalty is actually a, like it should be a lifestyle. It should be something that's supposed to be part of you. It should not something that I'm trying to see. Yeah, but at, at the same time, you still owe your partners those things. Because if you feel you love these people, this person, you shouldn't do some certain things to hurt them. There are, I, mean, I don't know some people that they don't grow up with those things. You have Calm down. No, there's people that don't have those things in them. But because you feel like I love this person, I don't want to hurt this person. I own this person, this particular thing. I just feel it's 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 just depends on me. Like, I stand on the fact, like I said earlier. Yes, you, you, expect people, you, you expect the worst from people, but you expect the worst from people. Same from thing people. that you will expect the worst from you too. Just like just like like, like somebody going to business, thinking about the profit alone. No, you should be thinking about the loss and the profit at the same time. So you cannot just tell me that I expect the worst from people. You expect the good and the bad from people. That's how it goes. So you cannot, no, you cannot just. You want to if you are saying it that way, if you are saying it that way, meaning you are painting everybody if black, you like everybody is. If you don't hurt yourself, just don't expect shit from people. I promise you. I mean, you people are full with that mindset. They are broken. That what I'm about know. broken. That is that is I'm what not I broken. know. I'm and again, right. you shouldn't give anybody license to, to you know, let let their to actions throw some, to throw some bad energy towards yes, you. Yes, let their actions affect you. Don't Me, I feel there's no love in the streets. If you have love in you, I don't get the reason why you have to go and look for it out there. If you take care of yourself, take care of your mind. Do things that will improve your inner energy or whatever it is. You attract good energy. Good energy attract good energy. Bad energy attracts bad energy. And if you take care of your, if you take care of yourself more, you 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 you, you, you like you know. I don't know where to put it. Like you love yourself, you fall in love with yourself. You you you, you will be able to detect when someone is trying to play you or when That's something is not real around you. you and and we should you stop, pick it, you stop pick like the what's up? up? Stop like. Um, having this mindset of oh this person bought me I forgot to promise so this love person me. will push up for me love me see those things are not love you just trying to catch fine, fine those things like someone that love you to actually do those things most time but one thing I want to say uh, is about this whole thing is like we've seen all from beginning if you love yourself you know how to love somebody correctly exactly. one now expecting or no expecting I feel if you if I tell you I love you I want to do what will hurt me. What 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 will do to me and hurt me? Of you to, to I will do. love you like you are my like you are me. So good all. love, good love. I love myself. Good love, good love, good healthy love. And I putting that love on you. I don't want to hurt you. It's not even expecting. Do you know if I you, love do you, know, you? Do you know if you're walking around saying that you don't owe people anything? Do you know how many? I don't know. Do you know how many people that you don't give a fuck about? I don't owe people anything, but you don't see me acting bitchy to people because I know what is right and what is wrong. Simple. Conclusion of this whole video is do you think there's anything that can be done for the next generation to see love on the street, to see the real love on the street? <laughs> yeah. Well I said love yourself, true. Not you, you have to teach them to love yeah. themselves now. Start we, with us we, now. We, we need to actually teach them how to love. That's by starting by love marrying this person you love. Marry the person how, how you love. How do you, so how do you that, expect how do you expect a broken person? To show somebody else show, love. As in, Please marry the person you love. Try, wow. Happiness if you, if, you start looking for, if you start looking for happiness from someone else, then you are being selfish. Yeah. Well, I don't get. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not done making myself happy. You want me to like? This. A, if you can't message. make yourself happy, you can't be happy anywhere. This, this, I will change for you. See, change for yourself. Love yourself enough to change for yourself. Don't love me. You have. If you have like better knowledge of what love, love is, is, I feel that this the, the world will be this and so it starts with and you make sure you marry someone that you love so, have, so your kid can grow up and see what true love looks like please thank you what does true love look like what is love love, love. 
Love is pure. Jesus. God Jesus is love. Is if you, you are looking for what love is, just think about how God gave us. It's only because of God. Love. I feel like no human can actually attain that amount of love, but if you can get like 1% of that love, I'm sure it will be better. It's not, it's not, love is not only about having sex. It's not, it's not even about sex at all. It's about sacrifice. <sighs> love is pure. <laughs> to me, I just feel it's, it's about sacrifice though, because to some extent, if you don't like people, you can't go to the, you can't go to like a stream yes. for them. So if you really love somebody, you make some sacrifice. I really have some... loved us to talk much, but we know that we can't do that. But in case you guys want to see more of this kind of videos, you guys should let me know. But what exactly is love? Let me know what you feel like. What love is in the comment section? And is there still love on the street? Love is money. Why? <laughs> is there still love on the street? Let me know. There's no love on the street, though. My brother, and my sister. There's no love. The comment section. There's no love. So, just, just love. Let sure. me go. Me go. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to love myself. Remember, but there was one time all of us we were looking for love up and down the street, but yeah, they broke our hearts to pieces. So uh, remember, remember to also leave a comment down below, subscribe, yeah. and don't do, don't be free. And don't forget, then. self love is the best. Kind love of yourself. Love. Period. Self-love. Period. If you love yourself. You can't. Pe- you can't allow anybody Period. to do anything to you. You cannot. You had her. You had her. Mm-hmm. Learn to love yourself. Mm-hmm. So, see ya. If you point of mind, we are able to convince you that <laughs> there is might not love on the streets. But if you have a different opinion, <laughs> let us know in the comments. Yeah. So, thank you very much. To be seen in our next video, make sure you have a wonderful day. I made your favorite beautiful, fun YouTuber. And thank you for coming to my channel. Thank you for coming to my channel, Bella, too. <laughs> Bella, <laughs> OG. I love you all. Oh, don't and great. to be seen in our next video. Bye. Peace out. <laughs>